But if you just want the tidbits, honey, I got you back. All right. Welcome to Shireen TV. I'm Shireen, founder of AwakenTheRebel.com, where we help people to stop settling for less and rebel in the direction of their dreams. So it's all about helping people break out of their little cubes, revolutionize their lives, all that good stuff. And in doing so, I don't know if you've caught the uh, first three parts of this six step video series, but I did get the privilege and honor of interviewing Jim Britt, who is the guy who mentored Tony Robbins in the first half of his career and holy crap, he's amazing. So I wanted to take that information, sort of synthesize it and share it with you. So we've been talking about the six top qualities of successful entrepreneurs and the number one, one, just to review, was a burning desire for a different life, for change, for something better. Second one is to make a decision and when you make that decision, you show up differently and people show up differently for you. Boom. Number three quality was to be bold. So say yes and figure it out later. Go for it. Throw poop at the wall. If you all remember me saying that last time, just had to make sure I said it again. Didn't want you to forget. Oh yeah. <laughs> Silly. You just need to freaking throw a big piece of poop at the wall and see if it sticks. All right, so uh, the fourth one, and that is today's quality, is to be willing to step out of your comfort zone. So, you know, like we talked about static action. So a lot of people kind of like come home from work and they use that extra money out of their jobs to go buy a bigger TV screen so they can be more comfortable, right? And comfort's great, it's great. Nothing wrong with comfort. However, you do have to get out of your comfort zone in order to create something different in your life. So, and this is the case with anything. If that's in, you know, if you want to get more fit, if you want to have a more happy relationship, if you want to have a better career, more money, whatever it is for you, if you want to have a happier relationship, you might have to go through the discomfort of going to couples therapy and really getting into the details of where this communication disconnect is happening and that's uncomfortable and that makes us feel weird and we're like, oh, I don't want to feel like there's something wrong with me. Forget it. Forget it. Forget it. So you either go through the discomfort and become somebody new on the other side so that you can receive this amazing better relationship or better life or whatever, or you kind of sit back and you don't go to a couples therapist because you don't want anyone to think there's anything wrong with you, and then you sort of still have the same problems that you had before, okay? Same thing with health. You have to go through the discomfort of not allowing yourself to eat that amazing looking fries, cheeseburger, and a Coke so that you can get out on the other side and be this like lean, green, gorgeous machine, you know what I'm saying? So there's just sort of a necessary amount of being willing to step out of your comfort zone when you are going to be a successful entrepreneur. All right, so that was quality number four. I hope you keep your eyes peeled. For next Friday, I'm gonna send you quality number five. And you know, for now, if you like this video, please do like it and share it with your people who you think would benefit, who would be into this info. Oh yeah, and it's free. Okay, so don't say I never gave you anything. Thank you, you're welcome, goodbye.